Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today is just a Saturday day in the life salon edition. As you can see, we do have a booked and busy Saturday today. All three of us are booked for today. So let's get into the video just to see what I do during the day. So right here, I'm just restocking some lashes that we were low on, um, taking them out the wrapper so that way I can just put them in the cubby in the back for the girls. So yes, in this clip, of course, you see me with my Red Bull. On Saturdays, normally, I do not have any type of break, so I try to at least have three to four Red Bulls, I kid you not, throughout the day. I know that's bad, but Red Bull is what keeps me up, especially working at eight to five. All right, so right here, this is my first client. We are doing a brow wax and tint service. Brow wax and tint is one of my most popular services at my salon and she added on a chin and lip wax. So that is what I'll be doing on her. This client is one of my OG regular clients. I see her probably every two to three weeks on a Saturday. Right here I'm just replenishing some of my supplies that I ran low on probably during the week and I didn't get to refill this morning so right here I'm just refilling q-tips and I will be refilling my wax paper strips as well so that way I don't run out of product supplies when I'm trying to do these brows
here is my second client. This is one of my client's sisters, little sisters. And she's just getting a really quick brow cleanup. I just had her a couple of months ago, so she really just had a little bit of cleanup. And here is her brows before. And we're about to get to work on them. In this clip, I'm showing you guys how I mix our tint. We use Nick Townsend at our salon. He is based out in Philly. So I am taking mahogany, which is just like a natural brown, and a dash of ebony, which is like a black tint, mixing it up with the developer, see the consistency. Then I go ahead and put that on my client's brows, and I normally let that sit for about 12 to 15 minutes, depending on the client. So normally for a timer, I use my phone or my Apple Watch. Right here, I'm obviously using my Apple Watch. And I'm gonna scroll down to 15 minutes to start her timer. Now these are just my girls in the back doing their lash clients. Stay tuned for the salon tour video. did arrive a little bit early but luckily my client beside her tent was still processing so I was able to go ahead and do her brow wax service
Is that Kimberly? Yes. We gonna have to. I don't want to have to get want, on her. I don't want her on my books anymore, honestly. I think. So one of my girls did have a client that did not show up that Saturday and I had to leave her a voicemail that went a little like this. Hi Kimberly, this is Stasia from Upgrade You Aesthetics. Um, you had an appointment with Nia today at 12.30. Um, we have already charged you for the service for today. Um, I'm just giving you a call to let you know that unfortunately since we've had a lot of complications with your appointments as far as not showing up or late, um, etc. We are unfortunately no longer able to service you at our salon. Um, I hope you have a great weekend and a great Thanksgiving as well. Bye. So in this clip, I'm just writing down all the services the girls have done so far. So for my ninth and last client, we are doing a quick brow wax on her. Basically just a cleanup.
Here we are at the end of the day. It is 4.51 and I am about to close up shop. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll catch y'all in the next one.